Hi, I'm going to teach you three quick win productivity tips. I first learned these tips when I read the book Getting Things Done by David Allen, which uh, I still practice to this day. And these were the first three things that I took away and they massively increased my productivity right from the start. So I hope they do the same for you. The first one is trying not to keep everything in my head, trying not to keep uh, my brain as uh, tracking all the things I need to do, but to just get them out of my brain, simply writing them down. So when I have an idea now, I get it out of my brain, either writing it down or recording it into my phone. And that allows me to make sure that I do it, that, uh, that I get it done. But more importantly for me is that it allows me to stop worrying about it in my brain and, and my, I don't get woken up at three o'clock in the morning thinking, oh, I must do that. So um, if I'm out walking my dog, uh, I may have a thought that, that bothers me. I want to enjoy walking my dog, I want to enjoy the rest of my walk. So I make a quick note of it and immediately my brain sort of lets go of this uh, task that I'm tracking and I can enjoy the rest of the walk and enjoy the scenery. Uh, so capturing is the first thing that I learned. The second thing is called the two minute rule. And it basically is just if you decide you need to do something and you can do it where you are with the tools that you have and you can do it in two minutes, you just do it there and then. You don't write it on a list. You don't uh, think about it for too much longer. You don't decide to write it on a post-it note and stick it on your computer screen. You just do it. Um, I found it the big step forward, big leap forward um, with procrastinating because like most of you, uh, I was a very bad procrastinator and the two minute rule gets past that. So find out what it is you need to do. Less than two minutes, just do it. The third thing is uh, an idea that comes from the book is that not everything has to go on the same list. So I used to be a real list keeper. I had a to-do list and everything was on it. It was a jumble. It was a jumble of things that I want to do now. It was a jumble of things I want to do sometime in the future. Some things were going to take me the rest of my life to do, like learn the piano or learn French. Um, some things I just needed to, to buy milk on the way home. And I used to put it all on the same list. And the idea in, in that David suggests in getting things done is that you can have different lists for different things. So today I have several what we call context specific lists um, and the one that I really like and really is useful is I have a list of calls that I can make. So when I'm in the back of a taxi, I don't have to look at all the things that I could possibly do in the world. I just look at phone calls I can make. And on that list is, is phone calls for a client to make a sale or possibly that I need to phone my sister to have a catch up about how she's doing and how my nephews are. Um, so they're the three quick wins. I really encourage you to have a go at them.